there's more and more research coming out about the cognitive benefits of exercise, maybe exercise as a prevention or a mitigating factor in cognitive decline. Are you optimistic about the cognitive benefits of exercise? I guess we can focus on acute cognitive benefits. So like maybe clearing your head or helping focus in the short term and long term benefits as well, because obviously you're getting more oxygen to the brain and stuff like that. Yeah. So a lot of this work is actually done around ADHD because we know there are cognitive difficulties if you have ADHD. And so they do a lot of the research to be able to understand how to support those people better. What it actually tells us is these elements are also incredibly effective for helping all of us keep up our cognitive abilities. So we used to think things like once you were over the age of being a child, um, you would lose, start to lose neurons in your brain. And there was nothing your brain could do to develop new neurons. We actually know that new neurons can be created in your brain. They're created in the hippocampus region, which is where your memory and learning are stored. And they're created by doing exercise. So a lot of the work is trying to find out what type of exercise is most effective. If there's almost like a prescription for exercise. And that's really hard because when they do studies, they test almost a specific prescription rather than testing all the different types you could do and then figuring out which one works the best. 